All right, guys, welcome to the OP art lesson or optical illusion art. We're going to make a picture that kind of looks like this. We're going to look at some artists that have kind of pioneered optical illusion art. This is art by M.C. Escher. He's famous for creating lots of different kinds of optical illusion art. Kind of plays tricks on the eyes. And this one is by Bridget Riley, and she's famous for creating OP art that looks like it's moving. Sometimes it hurts your eyes if you look too, at it for too long. This one actually is moving. Kind of messes up your eyes a little bit. Start by making a dot in the middle of your page and connecting lines to the outside using a ruler. So you're going to put four lines on the bottom of your page, two on the side, two, four on the top, and two on the other side for a total of 12 lines. Then you're going to pick two colors. Oh, sorry, no, next you're going to be creating kind of like frowny faces that alternate to you have a frowny face, you leave a space, frowny face, leave a space, frowny face, leave a space there. And you're gonna take those all the way up. Make sure you leave a space in between each of those sections. And then you're gonna go ahead and use a happy smile to go up the spaces in between. Take those all the way up, just like that. If you get to the top and you realize half your line goes off the page, that's okay. All right, almost done there. Now you're going to pick two colors. Um, I'm going to pick red and green. And you're going to start by coloring the middle and alternate between red and green, red and green, red and green, all the way around there. Now, oops, I made a mistake, but that's okay. I hope it'll look good anyways. Okay. And you're going to take that all the way up, but you're going to skip every kind of er, skip one. So you like color green, leave a white space, color green, leave a white space, color green, leave a white space all the way up. And then you do the same thing with the red. Kind of red, leave a white space, red, leave a white space, red, leave a white space all the way up. All right. And then you're done your picture and you've got your optical illusion art. It kind of looks like you're going into the picture.